Hi everyone, welcome back to another tutorial. Today we are going to design a select parametric column with a bookshelf in a SketchUp. If you enjoy this kind of tutorials, follow me till the end. And don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends. So let's jump in. So first, let's create a column, use circle tools, draw a circle by 40 cm, enter, then use push pull and extrude it by, for example, 400 cm, like this. Then select all and make it group. Now use rectangle tools and draw a rectangle here, like the axis, and draw a rectangle like this. And let me scale it to here, like this. Then use offset tools and take an offset by 30 cm, like this. Then select the middle surface and use scale tools and a scale here because we don't need here and here too like this then by using erase tool delete here like this now use arc tools and draw an arc here like this then again, use the push pull and extrude it by six centimeter. Select all and make it group two, like this. Now, use rotate tools, take from the center of the column then take a copy, press Ctrl to take a copy, rotate it by 15 degree and enter like this. Then type the number of copies 24x, enter like this. Now Hide the main column, then let me delete this one and select all. And by using union option of solid tools, make all of them in one single group. Use union like this. Now, as you can see, they changed in one single group like this now use circle tools and draw a circle up to here then use push pull tools and extrude it up to here select all and make it group two use move tools and move it up to here like this now let me scale it a little bit it's good now as you know we have two groups like this and now again use solid tools and subtract option as you can see we have two groups Take notes, the first selection will delete it. So be careful which one you select. For example, 
I don't need this cylinder. Let me select as a first selection and then our column like this. Now, as you can see, we cut the middle of the column because we need to create a bookshelf here. So now again, use circle tools and draw a circle up to here like this. Then let me use push pull and extrude it by five centimeter. Select all and make it group. Then use move tools and and move it here like this. Then again move tools, lock the axis, press control to take a copy and move it up to here. Now just divide by four like this. Let me go to edit menu and find and hide and hide less like this. So let me move the column here. As you can see, we need a hole, the center of shelves for our column. So let's do it. First, select all the shelves and use union to make them in a single group like this. Then use trim option of solid tools. First, select the column, then the shelves like this. Now it's done. Let's check it. Move the column here like this. As you can see, it's done. Now we have three groups like this. So guys, as you can see, our work is done. I hope this tutorial was useful and helpful for you. For more tutorials, please subscribe our YouTube channel if you haven't already. And don't forget to like, comment and share the video with your friends.